about four o'clock, five o'clock in the morning. Yeah. We woke up at four o'clock. We are flying from Phuket to Bangkok today where we're gonna spend a couple days before we fly off to England. But right now, we need to go get our tickets printed from here. And you can't bring rackets with electricity. Or hand grenades or pistols. update. It's still too early to check in. As you can see, so now we're in a little bit. I think we're too early for anything in the Bukat airport to be open. went to check in for our flight. Um, our bags were a little overweight, so we had to take some things out of them and then check them. Now we are at Viet Air Jet, paying the bill for the booked luggage, checked luggage. And we gotta go back down there to get our boarding passes. Okay, we're ready. just took a bus ride from the hotel. We're going to check out the Grand Palace. The bus ride took a very long time. That is something we've learned here. Traffic is horrendous and everything takes longer than we expect. But I'm excited to go see it. We can already like see some of the skyline and it's beautiful. <whistles> Made a mistake. We got all the way to the Grand Palace and you need to be covered, shoulders and knees. And I'm in a skirt and a tank top. I don't know why I didn't even think about that. That was silly of me. So I think I have to buy something to cover up so that we can go in because it was quite the adventure to get here. And I don't really want to come back tomorrow. So, and now someone's, I don't know what they're asking us for. So, bye. We managed to get ourselves covered up enough to go into the palace, but now we can't actually figure out how to get inside. So we're just wandering around in our, uh, in our street outfits. Well, we made it to the Grand Palace. Uh, you do, everybody has to cover up their knees, and I think it's preferred that women cover up shoulders, what it looks like. Uh, and we found out that there's really not much you can do once you get in unless you buy the tickets, which are... 500 baht a person, which is like 20 bucks. Um, and we had originally read like you could wander around without a ticket and see the grounds, but you really can't. To get in, you have to buy a ticket. You don't wear regular like pants. You have to buy pants. Decided we came all this way, so we're gonna go in. We're gonna pay the ticket price, whatever a thousand baht or something, and check out the Grand Palace. Yeah, from here it looks like it's gonna be super pretty. So, how many times are we gonna come to Bangkok? You know. Thank you.
just inside the temple of the Emerald Buddha and it's incredible. I mean, this temple is so ornate. Everything on the palace grounds is so ornate. So we're inside the Grand Palace. This is the residence where I'm assuming the king or the monarch king. lived. When was this made? 1728. So yeah, the complex was established in 1782. 82. And this building wasn't built until the 1800s. But the whole complex is just massive and incredible. Yeah, it's beautiful. I'm glad we bought tickets. This is pretty cool. Worth coming inside. All right, the plan for the rest of the afternoon, I think we're gonna grab some lunch and then we're gonna go to the, what's it called? I don't remember, but it's a weekend market and today's Sunday. So if we wanna go, we have to go today and it's supposed to be really cool. We'll yeah. tell you what it's called when we look it up. <laughs> We're about to hop on the Sky Train, so we've officially taken like every form of public transportation today. Bus, metro, and Sky Train. We made it to Chapachook Market. It is wild, it's super busy, yeah. so many stands. We've barely scratched the surface, so let's see what we can find. Usually when we're exploring like this, Rob and I would like maybe like go look at the different things that we're both interested in, but in a place like this, we would get separated from each other so fast. Definitely important to keep eyes on. 